and welcome back guys uh, this is the week week number eight of my learn python with google video log um, and in the week number eight which was the week um, uh, before the 6th of april i worked on this assignment i started working on this assignment um, the regular expressions so working with regex because the module 3 of the course uh, using python to interact with the operative system was about regular expressions honestly it wasn't the easiest thing i have done uh, it took me a while to figure out and understand this topic because it's quite uh, complicated it's not really um, it's not really a basic topic it's kind of intermediate advanced um, programming um, topic uh, but at the end I got it and as you see I passed this lab um, uh, with 100% of score of course uh, so completed the assessment of the module 3 the regex I moved forward and I started uh, studying uh, the module 4 which was about managing data and processes and here we studied mm, data streams uh, reading data interactively um, uh, the standard streams uh, the environment variables the uh, common line arguments and the exit, sta exit status um, then at the end of this section uh, so we started this section with the the first section of the module 4 uh, with the managing data and processes topic and at the end of this uh, section there was a five question quiz uh, just to make sure you understood the topic <clears throat> then the second section of the module 4 uh, was related to Python sub-processes uh, where we used the sub-process module uh, in Python <coughs> and we studied how to uh, run system commands uh, in Python and how to obtain the output of a command uh, and some other advanced topics uh, concepts uh, then again there was another quiz uh, another five questions uh, to close the section and make sure we understood everything and validate our new knowledge uh, then the final section of the module 4 uh, which I completed during the uh, week number 8 of this uh, video log uh, was about the um, uh, how to process fi log files using Python and here we use the regex uh, to filter log files and retrieve some information and then at the end of this section again uh, we did five more uh, questions um, as part of a quiz uh, before moving to the um, graded assessment of this module and at the end of the module there was of course as I say the graded assessment which was this one so I completed it on the uh, 13th of April um, and it was about working with log files uh, the assignment was quite easy uh, it took me just a few minutes to uh, complete it it wasn't really anything hard to, um, to do uh, then I moved uh, again forward uh, and started the fifth module um, the fifth module the fifth module was about testing uh, in Python uh, in the first section of the module uh, we studied simple simple test concepts uh, like uh, we got an introduction uh, from the structure uh, about uh, how uh, testing works in Python and we covered the basic difference uh, between manual testing and automated testing um, then we had to go through another quiz uh, five more questions before moving forward and I must say that this section was quite interesting the module about testing um, 
and uh, testing in general is quite a good approach I mean uh, in the software development um, and at the same time was interesting but quite complicated uh, so I moved to the other uh, section of this module that was about unit testing uh, so we studied how to write unit tests in Python uh, we, we wrote some edge cases uh, and then some more edge cases and then to close this section we did some practice on the Jupyter notebook for about one hour uh, just to make sure that everything was uh, crystal clear uh, then we moved uh, I moved to the third module of the to the to the third section of the module uh, there was about uh, some more uh, test concepts concepts like uh, white box and uh, black box um, testing so the different between these two concept concepts then uh, we uh, saw the different types of tests that are available in Python, like unit tests, integration tests, smoke tests, load tests, or uh, regression tests. And then we studied um, test driven development. Uh, and then to close again this section, we did five more questions uh, in a quiz. Uh, so then uh, the final section before the assignment um, that was this assignment here. Uh, implementing unit testing in Python, which I did the following week actually. Um, so the final mm, section of this uh, module was uh, about how to handle errors. Uh, so they try accept construct uh, and how to test for expected errors. And then here we did some products using the Jupyter notebook again for roughly one hour. Uh, so my week um, the week eight, so this week pretty much ended uh, ended there, um, and I can assure you it was quite hard um, to manage to learn all these uh, different concepts in all uh, in a single week. Um, but mostly the section about testing uh, was quite challenging. Uh, at the end of the uh, course. I guess I will take a couple of weeks to consolidate this knowledge so probably we go through uh, the um, module of the this new course that uh, were more difficult to um, to go through and then I will probably build another consolidation plan around this new course that I've just uh, completed actually uh, so that's it for this week. I'll see you next week for uh, the week nine of my uh, video log. And as always, stay home, protect your family, and save your ass. Bye.